All right, so the Bronco is packed. We are leaving Galveston right now, heading to San Antonio. San Antonio, yay! We'll see you then. here at the Holiday Inn near downtown San Antonio and this how the hell did you get me up at 7 30 in the morning I know 7 30 in the morning but this hotel supposedly has a real good breakfast so we're gonna go down and try it out well let's see how the breakfast looks so lots of stuff to put on your food jams and salt and pepper and peanut butter breads wrapped in plastic and Sweet rolls. These actually look fresh made. And then we got scrambled eggs, and then pork sausage and hash browns. Uh, more oatmeal and stuff to put on oatmeal. We got cereal. Three different kinds of cereal and uh, milk. Got some juices down here: cranberry juice, and apple juice, and of course a juice machine with apple, cranberry, water, and orange juice, and a little bit of fresh fruit. All right, so I'm having scrambled eggs and potatoes and sausage and a cinnamon roll that looks really good. Warm cinnamon roll. Huh? Warm cinnamon roll. I'm Warm cinnamon roll. Sausage, sausage is good, potatoes are good. No eggs for you? Cin no, no eggs for me. And you're having, uh, like me, the OJ. And coffee and OJ. Your usual sugary coffee. My sugary coffee, yes, I can't tell you. Well, it looks really good. Let's see how it tastes. It's actually a really nice little breakfast area, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then back in that doorway in there is where you actually get your breakfast. Watch some TV. Scrumptious, Scrumptious. especially the cinnamon roll. And you're reading your book while you have your breakfast. Yes, I'm not much of a conversationalist. <laughs> well, and then uh, you have the eggs, the potatoes, all good. The sausage was excellent. It's the best, uh, the best breakfast sausage I've had in one of these hotels so far. Tastes like an actual breakfast sausage. <laughs> it was yummy. Not like a little hot dog. <laughs> and that cinnamon roll is really good. It tastes fresh. It's warm. So, so uh, nice collection of free weights. And uh, I use this epileptical. Am I saying that right? How do you say it? Elliptical. <laughs> I used that this morning. I love that thing. Epileptical. Is that somebody who has epilepsy? Is it? <laughs> Elliptical. Okay. I had to see how it was. <laughs> anyway, I got a good workout this morning. How's your workout? I'm having a good laugh. That's good. That's oh, yeah. No, I'm just kidding. No, I, I, I like stumbled the, over my tongue. I like the, the, the elliptical. Huh? I like the elliptical as well. I, I, I like the gym here. They keep it a nice temperature. It's pretty good. I've been getting really good workouts in here. Okay, so we're in downtown San Antonio at the most revered and holiest shrine in all the state. And that is the Alamo. Now, it's a cool place, and we would love to take you inside, but they don't allow cameras. So, this is all you're gonna see in our video. The front of the, the uh, Alamo, and what remains of it. So where do you, exactly do you think Ozzy peed? Where did Ozzy do his thing? I don't know. <laughs> Terrible. I know, but uh, so why not? Anyway, 
I understand the majority of the Alamo has been destroyed. This is the little part that's left. So that's it. And of course, lots and lots of stuff to see in the big square that is here at the uh, Alamo. But the Alamo is not the only really cool thing or cool place to go in San Antonio. Downtown San Antonio is among the most beautiful in the world. It's full of old churches, uh, old historical buildings that are well maintained and taken care of. And when you walk through downtown San Antonio, you notice that there's not any of those crappy parking lots you see in most downtowns. No boarded up buildings. It's just beautiful and well kept down here. But I'm just talking about street level San Antonio. When you walk around the downtown of San Antonio, you'll notice stairwells going down in different corners of the streets. And uh, when you go down one of those stairs, that's where you really see San Antonio at its most magical. Now the Riverwalk winds for several miles through downtown San Antonio below ground level. You can feel the temperature drop several degrees when you come down here. It's so cool and comfortable. And it's lined with restaurants and stores and bars uh, and of course you can take rides on the little boats or tours not on that boat. huh not on that boat yeah not on that boat <laughs> that's a police boat and the river walk. <laughs> i never i never seen that before no i have that's haven't. pretty cool Okay, so our time is done in San Antonio uh, at the uh, Holiday Inn Express, which is the downtown location. What did you think of the hotel? Mostly good, mostly good. Um, the, the breakfast is really good. Um, there's a girl at the front desk who's amazing. Her name's Giselle. She was like incredibly, incredibly nice and helpful yeah. in everything. The gym was good. I had one, one glaring negative. The carpeting 
is dirty. Not that it, need, it didn't need to be vacuumed. It's dirty. You can't walk on it for even two minutes and your feet turn black. That was my one glaring negative. Everything else was, you know, um, I'd say a little more than about, I'd say above average. So what kind of rating do you give it out of five? Out of five? Four, maybe? I didn't like it that much. <laughs> First of all, the good, the breakfast was good. It's probably the best breakfast we've had in any of the hotels we've stayed at so far. The breakfast sausage tasted like breakfast sausage. It's kind of amazing. And then the potatoes, they, look, they tasted like they fried them. So they're like little mini McDonald's potato cakes. But that's pretty much where it ended. The room was dirty. And uh, when I pulled the, there's a little couch in the room in here that's a sleep, sleeping bed. Or sleep, I forgot anyway. about that. Yeah, hideaway bed. I pulled a cushion off of it. There was a dirty bra strapped in or tucked in there. So clearly they don't clean the place very well. Uh, like she said, the floor is dirty. Um, the bathroom was clean. Uh, the pool was a joke. There was no hot tub. Oh yeah, I forgot about the pool and the hot tub. There's a hot tub advertised at this hotel. When you pull up the website, it says they have a hot tub. This is what we got. I forgot about the hot tub. This is what we got, a, a tub full of gravel. <laughs> and the pool was dirty. We didn't even get in it. I didn't even look at it because you told me it's... Oh, the pool I was dirty. The pool. So, you know, we like to relax by the pool, especially in the evening with a drink. And we like to sit in a hot tub. That's when we book a room, we make sure it has a hot tub. We check and see if there's a hot tub. Don't advertise that you have something and then when we get here, don't have it. So all those were big negatives for me. Also, another big negative for me was the Wi-Fi. This is the worst Wi-Fi we've encountered. It was spotty. The location was okay. It's walking distance to downtown uh, San Antonio, which yeah. as you know by now is fantastic. But um, too many negatives for me. I'm giving the room like a 2.8. So <laughs> no maybe hot tub. I, I, maybe I was overly nice. I forgot about the pool because... And the gym was decent. Gym I'll was give it that. But see, this is the thing. Yeah, Work out and then I want to get in a hot tub, you know, because I'm old and my bones and joints or sore and I need that hot tub. We didn't get it. So yeah, I'm still sticking with my, what did I say, 2.8? 2.8 for the hotel, for hotel or the Holiday Inn downtown San Antonio. So anyway, we got to go to Dallas for a few days to check on the kids to make sure they haven't burned the city down. And uh, after that, we're heading to Austin and Corpus Christi, then the South Padre Island. We're gonna check out SpaceX while we're down there. We're gonna go and hit Brownsville. Then we're gonna cruise along the border. Laredo, Eagle Pass, Del Rio, which there's been a lot of news lately. Into El Paso. After that, Arizona and Southern California and then up into Las Vegas. So come with us on the trip. Okay? All right, Till next time.